Hey, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to more Wrestle Quest. My name is Raven from the Sky. So you thought your outfit was too bright? Goth or exactly. surfer? I knew I needed to darken my image up a bit, but I didn't want to go too far. Then um, I just have the same problem, but in the other direction. No time for fashion talk now. Future boots. Hey, watch it. Did you guys figure it out? Did you fix the well? my god you've returned good time is up the spirit well demands a sacrifice unless of course you found a way to fix our spirit well hey I bet we can fix him instead <laughs> spirit well shall glow once more amigos perhaps I was wrong perhaps the spirit well does need a sacrifice and that fact sacrifice is you working the well lives once more this is a great day for gator King. the surfer bird is free to go my scaly brethren tonight we celebrate glad it's over thanks for saving us don't mention it dude can you still open up the way to malibu heights sure can now that i'm free but i wanted to ask you something why did you want to leave boxwood anyways the brooder Let's just say I had some investments turn out differently than what I had planned. Anyways, we're going to Malibu Heights for the mall brawl. You? And the mall brawl? Ha! Huh. Get serious, Bruder. Elephant would never let a third raid has been like you set foot in the mall brawl. Take some notes. The Bruder's no has been. He and 26 inch cobras got us through this jungle. And they helped us save your sorry beak. So cut the sarcasm, show the man some respect. Right, I, uh, I'm sorry. Either way, I'll go on ahead and clear the way so you can continue on the onto Malibu Heights. Though it's going to involve a little cosmic Thanks. detour. What does that suppose to mean? You'll see. Come on, amigos. It's time to go shopping. How's it growing, Ranger? It'll heal, Brink. Listen, what you did up there. Sorry for the improvision. I just wanted to preserve the original direction of the match. Son, you did more than that. You gave us a better send off than we could have asked for. Yeah, that was some quick thinking in there. Tell the truth, Brink. I, sh I wish it was you that was protecting our honor and not that juice box guy like Mr. Font wrote it. I, uh, thank you, but I trust Mr. Font's instincts. I understand, son, you're obedient and loyal and admirable qualities. Just don't let your obedience compromise your values. Well, that's enough out of me. What do you say, Bradshaw? Hit to the mess hall? Not a bad intro for the Honest Bucks, eh? You know it. Now, before we get too cocky, let's see Mr. Fawn about our follow-up match. Uh, I was just getting used to winning, too. That was some quick thinking out there, Brink. You saved the match and United Front's reputation. Thank you, sir. I'm glad it worked out. Okay, ready for some mic work before the next fight? The plan is for you to deny any wrongdoing in the last match. You know, heal it up real big. So we want to kick off some negative hype. Exactly. Then Big Daddy Squeeze comes out and challenges you to restore ML NWL's honor. Put him down three times, but let him kick out. Then he'll finish you guys off. Got it? Oh, we got 
that idiot, that juice box. <laughs> now, you honest bucks, we've called you back to the ring here because it was a description in the last match. Discrepancy? My well, discrepancy was that the old war dogs were even allowed near the ring. Maybe you should get your eyes checked, Gene. We won that fair. We won that one fair and square. Just a couple of honest bucks doing what they do best. <sighs> Come on now, you can't honestly tell me that you think that you think bringing a foreign object like that chair into the ring was fair game. Maybe some vitamin J will make them come clean, Gene. Big Daddy Squeezer, you let me tell you something, Gene. The only thing I hate more than cheaters is hillbillies. What is he talking about? That has nothing to do with the United Front. It seems out of control. He's going to ruin the promo. Gene, we did not any wrongdoing in that last match. The chair was considered part of the ring. We, Gene, these two hicks don't deserve to be on the same stage as me. You don't deserve to be in the same toy box as these fine soldiers, you juice head. These hicks are going to turn you into a pile of bricks. <laughs> oh, I should have chose the other one. Ah, bricks just click, just bricks Joe click, click. You know what I mean? Best now. Is he okay? Frank, this dude is off his rocker. I think he'll try to take us out before we can complete the script. Just stay cool, man. They call me the professional for a reason. I take one shot. Squirt and squirt. I'm leaking juice over here. Antler bomb. Ouch. Wait a minute, Jay. I'm leaking juice over here. I'm locked and loaded. Ouch. Oh my god, he gets Check this out. You're about to get my straw through your face. He has full health though. Press and squeeze. Check this out. Two ninety. Squirt and juice and time, baby. You're about 
to get my straw through your face. <laughs> of execution. Oh, Look at that. The juice. Probably drinks it as it gets up. <laughs> Reset button. It ain't easy to beat the squeezy. Yar. You're about to get my straw through your face. What do you think about your big title? Ladies and gentlemen, your winner after a dramatic comeback, Big Daddy Squeeze.
you see that lunk? He tried to take my antlers off. I'm not a hitman. I know. He was completely unhinged. Let's steer clear of him until we can bring this up with Mr. Font. Agreed. There's no time for that right now anyway. Sergeant Slaughter is about to give his speech. Sergeant, sir, my amigos and I have a gift for you. This, this private, I'm speechle speechless. I can't thank you enough. Not just me, Sergeant. The honest bucks were with me every step of the way. At least some people are more honorable than the juice box, eh? Copy that. You can say that again. Thank you, boys. This is just what I needed. All right, that's enough, you maggots. Quiet. <gasps> For years now, the Military Wrestling League has defended the glory fields, defended it from enemies, defended it from wrestling mediocrity. But now, their time is coming to a close. Today, my itty bitty ditty bag was returned to me. I've sent entire platoons of enemies home in this bag. Entire brigades mashed up and mailed home to mama. But MWL soldiers and wrestlers, even this bag cannot contain the amount of respect and admiration I have for your service. Now, your mission is at an end. Your flag is coming down now. It is time to head home. Time to heal, time to rest. And that, my dear compatriots, is an order. There's always a contingency. Your mission is at an end. Fitting words for the end of the MWL, but not for PAW, not for us. I'm traveling to Malibu Heights to prepare for the Mall Brawl event. It is a block tower match with a big payoff. With some headlining PAW superstars like Dash Talent, and Big Daddy Squeeze. My informants tell me there might be a spicy and unwelcome surprise there as well. What? Something you want me to take care of, Mr. Font? Not yet. As for you two, the Honest Bucks are headed south to San Sebastian to start a feud with grad school. That tyrannical heel stable? The very same. I'll have some scripts waiting for you when you land. Just go up to the docks and the boat will take you down near San Sebastian. San Sebastian, isn't it? Isn't that where Luchador's from? Yes, you're right. We can see if he can give us the scoop on the local scene. Let's ask him about it. Honest Bucks, here to say goodbye, I presume. Roger, Roger. We're headed to San Sebastian for BAW's Tag Team Division Championship. We thought you could give us some tips since that's your home turf, or surf, I guess. And caramba, you're going to San Sebastian? This is wonderful news. My wife and I would be insulted if you did not let us repay the debt I owe you for helping me recover Sergeant Slaughter's relic. Speaking of which, Sergeant, Sol Sergeant Slaughter wanted me wanted to meet us to give us a rule for our efforts. You can say that again, Private. You boys have grit like I haven't seen in years. Makes me think I got a few more tours of duty in me. I'm saying that I'm your new manager, boys. Wow, Mr. Slaughter. Sergeant, I quit your stuttering. This won't be a walk in the park. You hear me, maggot? Get ready for boot camp like you've never seen before. <laughs> Wonderful. Shall we be off? All right. I'm looking forward to San Sebastian food, elote, carnitas, and maybe a fish taco. Ah, forget that last one, okay?
I walk all the way back up there. Mess up there with enemies respawning. Let me not let me shut up and not jinx it. I've already done. Copy that. Hey, I recognize this place. I've seen postcards. Is this a Peril at Quest of Barra Silver Mine board game? We have to go through here to get to San Sebastian, but when we do, we will have quite a fiesta to welcome you to our town. Just wait until you meet my wife. She's the best. Best what? Best everything. Heh, <laughs> especially in the... Husband! You better not be sharing private details again. Ah, no, of course not. I would never... Good. Remember what happened last time. Vita, allow me to introduce Brink and Stag Logan, the Honest Bucks. They're here for a tag team championship. We're always happy to meet another member of the Luchador family. Luchador. Then you're in luck. I'm here with our children. And my Lochaninos. This is a bit out of the way for our family outing, isn't it? Luchador Championship Wrestling is having an event here to show off the high-flying skills of our Luchadors and Lochadoras. Um, they've installed several turnbuckles of ropes to act as springboards. The kids want to see. What fun! I wish I could have helped. It has been too long since I've seen them. Come on, Carnino. You can at least help me wrangle them back home. My secret is a rumble. Ah, where are the Luchinos? One day, Luchador will come home to us. Stampede. Where'd it come from? Lochador, the children, save them. Kids, just stay put. I'm coming. Mi amigos, I... We're with you, Lochador. Let's do this. And I'm going to stop here for today, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks for watching. And my name is Raven from the Sky. If you enjoyed the episode, drop a like and subscribe to the channel and the series grow. Take care, and I'll catch you guys in the next episode. Peace out.